Just about ready to get started here. I booted the system and got everything ready to go, and we are just about set up. Ah, what a day! What a day! What a day! Tomorrow is my day off, so I'm probably gonna be watching Fallout for a majority of the day. I probably might start a little bit early to get like a game in, because what's gonna happen is after I could probably start around like twelve or one, depending what time I get up. Play a game for a little while until uh, my until buddy shows up after work. Then we're gonna watch Fallout together. <laughs> Get episode six, seven, and eight, probably. And then maybe if I'm not too intoxicated after that, I'll probably start with more. Uh, start with a different game. It'd be variety A side and variety B side. It's gonna be set up like an old cassette tape. <laughs> All right, uh, oh, camera twitch. All right, let me switch on over. So yesterday I talked about it earlier, but I tried uh, the monster, the beast, the beast drink, the one with alcohol in it. But it's honestly, uh, what I got told today was that it actually doesn't have any caffeine in it. Due to other, due to legal reasons, it can't have caffeine and alcohol mixed together. So even if I finished, uh, if, if if I drank this beast yesterday, I would have been totally fine because it would have kept me up. But could have a placebo. Who knows? Give me a second. Give me a second. Huh? 
Okay. Well, we're still working on the Five Kings situation, so... Let's go back and collect our money. There's not a fight going on, is there? There is. Where is it at? Where am I at? Going the wrong way. Going the wrong way is what I'm doing. So I already know that the peach is absolutely Ooh. delicious. So I'm gonna try this this other one that I have, the one that I didn't try yesterday. The monster, monster beast. Uh, it's called Scary Berries. Let me try that here in a bit. Oh. But let's clear up this misunderstanding and start the collection again. Alright, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, man. Give me a second. Hmm. I mean, it's okay. The berry flavor is not all that strong. Which is a saving grace, I guess? Punch him in the face. Okay, that wasn't quite the punch in the face I was hoping for, but oh well. How's the grind? Ah, uh, it's going okay. Just gotta wait for the money. Which is why I probably worry well, this all, uh, what all the all the side quest thing stuff is for. This is the wrong street. Yeah. Okay, I don't think I have any really open quests right now, as far as I know. Got the chicken. Oh, we got the hiring situation. I guess it's the only real side quest I have. This one's fully... yep. Okay, let's get some investing done.
200 million. Never thought I'd see the day. You almost caught it to me in the Fallout show? Nice. Yeah, episode 5 is pretty good. Okay. What other areas do we have in Electronic King's place? Here we are. Pachinko 777 and Tenpo Sushi. Ooh. 254. Watching an episode before work. That's good. How much was Gibson Hall again? It was like 300 something, right? All right, let's see if we can buy one of the episodes. Uh, one of the episodes. One of the slots on the Gambling Kings area. Oh, got turned around. Camera! Camera station? That's an area, yeah. right? This is a cinema, right? You were sad before you wanted to work. Why was that? What did you do? How much is this? I am so short right now. No. <laughs> How much is the Gibson Hall, 307. Actually, we, able, we might be able to get this uh, Pachinko Hall if we get that last collection. the video of the Viking I sent earlier? Uh, I had not. And I don't have my phone on me right now. It's charging, right? Because my work phone is about to die. It's like, at, like well, it's at 30%, so we've got some time before it dies. But let's see how that goes. Buy that cinema hall. I think I have my headphones backwards. Let's see. 
Okay, no, I think they're on right. Okay, let's double check there's no competitions going on. No fights. Okay. See if we can go into the club arena. I haven't tried. But it'd be good to give it a shot, maybe. Okay, I actually do have these backwards. King of Rohan actor died. Oh, that's very sad. You see, Nishiki. This time, sorry. I'm 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 sorry. あんたを巻き込んじまった。怪我はなかったか。私のことは大丈夫。心配しないで。そうか。それより、キリュウさんの方こそ大丈夫なの今も追われてるんでしょ道島組に。ああ。だが、ひとまず追っては来なくなるように
I'm over the limit. Oh, right here. Okay. Okay, here we go. Tiger. 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 Weaker frame, but you have strong gears. We had to trim in the balance, uh, the balance battery, so we can go faster. Oh, so we can be under the limit. Okay, it looks like we can just win it, win this up straight. We just. <laughs> Straight up power. No, uh... we, we're too fast. We went too fast. <laughs> okay, we need to find a better setup for this one. I think we need that, uh... The gears are too powerful, probably. And this isn't even the max speed we can go. We have the high capacity and the high speed, which means we can go even faster. <laughs> I need these. We're really over it. We're really over that limit. Probably all I can really do. I mean, a grip goes up and the acceleration goes down. A balance is fine. These soft tires might work. It won't work well on slope. It might work well for everything else. So we'll try this one out. Uh, let's see if we get this get it this time. コースアウトするレーサーが多いのがこのコース。みんな対策はしてるかな？このコースの主役はなんといっても急カーブだ。気を抜くと一発でコースアウトするぞ。Means I'm going to slow down a bit. Um. 
Oh, my stamina is not going to come back good enough. Oh, my stamina is dead. Oh, he's still in. He's still in it. The boy's still in it. Come on, build that stamina. Build that stamina. Come on, boy. No! <laughs> The gear is too powerful. That, it drains my stamina so much. Okay, let's see. Let's take a test order. Let's see what we need to change. Low stamina in a dream. What does this plus do? It does absolutely nothing. This one. Okay, going on the outside. Absolutely tossed. Okay, the metal frame didn't help us at all. Power motor plus with these levels. We're also under the switch, so we might be able to do something else. Tires to spike three. Who has a drink in honor of King of Rodane? Who rode on? I said we're game. I was thinking of uh I was thinking of uh fucking Elden Ring. <laughs> the Thailden. The king of Rohan. I said we too. <laughs> okay, it's actually taking these corners not too bad. Yeah, that seems to fix my crashing problem. I shouldn't take so many drinks of these berries so quick after a, after another. Okay, I have to make it under the two about the two minute mark. If I can do that, I can win this race pretty easily. 
I think it was like 2.30? 2.15? I've solved my crashing problem. Now I need to see if I get the... The other problem. The falling off problem. Or the speed problem. Almost there. I slowed myself incredibly well. Two twenty. Okay. I might make it. Two thirty-four. That's a little bit slow, but it could be doable. Let's try it. Yes. I at least didn't die. Course out of the race, I go in the Konokos. Mina, Thais like a stericana. Okay, I finished this uh, monster a lot faster than I thought it would. Konokos, the, the initial taste was actually very weak. But after drinking the whole, literally, almost the whole can, it actually tastes pretty good. I got used to the taste very quickly. Alright, let's just slow me down quite a bit. お、<笑> Okay, they're coming up on me. Oh, it's lap number five and I'm about to be passed. We wait for it, we wait for it. Wait for the boost. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna catch up here right now. I'm gonna get past again. I didn't gain as much distance away from the first place as I thought I would have. Damn, he's just pulling ahead. He's won this one. Damn. Second place is not bad, but it's not! Third now. I need a better motor, that's for sure. It's one level higher and I should be fine. Dream Machine again? Maybe, let's see. I at least finished the race. I'm glad about that. What? 
Come on, Hideki Kun, let's race. Mm -hmm. Oh, hi, Cousin Makun. Did you want to play with us? Yeah. No, not exactly. I thought I heard a familiar voice and it turned out to be you. So, how'd it go? Are you back in good with your friend Hideki? <laughs> well... I'm busy right now. I don't have time to race with you, Takamakun. You say you're busy, but it's just us and you don't seem to be doing anything. Well, I'm about to be busy real soon, so just go away, Takamakun. What are you doing, Hideki Kun? Oh. Uh. Mika chan. Hideki Kun, who are these guys? Uh, uh, this is my pocket circuit buddy, Takamakun, and. And Kazumakun. Oh, how neat! I don't have any pocket second friends besides Hideki-kun. Can you be my friend too? Uh. Oh, of course. Right, Kazuma-kun. Uh, uh, sure, no problem. Mm. Uh. Nah, nah. Isn't Kazuma-kun really cool? He's a super fast pocket circuit racer too. Oh, wow, neat. Kazuma-kun is cool, isn't he? He's all grown up. And he's even a fast racer too. I really like boys. What good pocket circuit racers? Um, uh, okay. Uh, hold it! Stop it right! Stop it right there! Ah! Whoa! What's the matter, Hideki Kun? Mika Chan, I'm, I'm faster than Kazuma Kun, and and I'm cooler too. Uh, um, whatever. I'm pretty sure Kazuma Kun is way cooler. I get it now. Hideki Kun has a thing for Mika chan. <laughs> he wanted to keep Mika chan all to himself, so he tried to keep Takuma Kun away. Well, it's intriguing even amongst little kids. I am fast for sure, and I'll prove it. Takuma Kun, I challenge you to a race. Nani. Race? With me? Uh. Yep, I'm gonna prove to Mika chan that I'm faster than you. I'm going to get ready at the Parker Circus Stadium. Don't check it out, I'll be waiting. Let's go, Mika Chan. Huh? Huh? Uh, okay. Bye, Kazuma Kun and Takuma Kun. Wow, it's gonna be awesome watching you race, Kazuma Kun. I think it's pretty fast, too. So watch out. How did I get drag dragged into this? But I can't back out down now. I'll go to the Pocket Circus Stadium when I get a chance. I feel like I read that wrong, too. I cannot back down, can I? Ah, <laughs> uh, it's not ready. Well, I was initially planning on fishing, so we'll continue with that endeavor. Are you gonna look at me weird again? Yeah, you are. I don't have any bait. There we go. We're sea fishing. Sea fishing, Captain. I got the sea master. <laughs> I don't have any bait on me. Ooh, there's a big one right there. Hmm. Got 
Come on, big fish. Come on, big fish. Show some interest, big fish. Show some interest, big fish. He's coming back. He's coming back. I don't think he's coming back. Oh, wait. He's coming back. I just threw it randomly out there. Alright, whatever we catch is we catch. Colon cat. That's a very old fish. We just wait as the water sway to and fro as this random one just decides to bite on right in the middle of my sentence. Squid. We got a squid. Squid is what we got today. I don't think I actually threw this in any vicinity of any of the fish that are here. I can't really see everything. Very dark waters. Hmm. Come on. You're just sitting there. You're not expecting anything to happen, are you? There we go. <laughs> I gotta see if Don Quixote are the other place. Entirely sure what that is, but we'll take it. I gotta see if Don Quixote or the pawn shop has any um, motors or batteries that I can use. The biggest thing is I don't have. I don't think my motor. My motor is too strong. And it's really. <laughs> Let's throw one over here. Hmm. As we sit in these dark waters, we ponder the questions of what is exactly in the ocean. Is water? Is salt water? Is fish? Is tropical fish? Are there plant? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I got a bag. Nanda Koreba. A Boston bag. I, I think that takes all my uh, room right now. I don't think I have room for anything else. One more. Is she ready to train me now? Uh. Yeah, true. Basically, I'm gonna ask you to help me collect on some scum, scum suckers who want big money. I'll give you a target, use what you learned to get it done. Got uh. it? I see one thing, though. What? You get a chicken out now? 
Yeah. No, I just wanted to know why you don't do this yourself. Well, I just got a little too notorious for my own good. Hmm? What do you mean? Lately, I've been running into this problem where my targets already know I'm coming. So I get there and they've already blown the coop. Or worse, they're aiming guns at the door. I'm good, but I'm only good while I'm breathing. So if I get jobs that I catch a whiff of stink on, I'm going to send you. Nobody knows you just yet. I get it. You must really made it. You must have really made a name for yourself. It's a pain in the ass. Anyway, I'm sure once the real battle starts, your training will pay off. You'll no doubt learn a few new moves along the way as well. And I'll even let you keep all the money you collect. How's that for a little incentive? Uh, sound good. I might take you up on that sometime. How about right now? <laughs> ah, Kitty, you ready to go to beast mode? Uh, yeah, sounds good. Miss Tatsu's jobs. I have a job for you. You interested? Let's do it. Uh, yeah, I'm in. Let me tell you who you're up against. The target is a guy called Tetsuya the Gigolo. He couldn't make do with the money from the girls he lives off. So he's been taking out loans he's never going to pay back. And once the loan sharks see him drowning, he foists the loans onto some unlucky lady. Moves on to the next gullible floozy. Scum of the earth, basically. Hmm. And why would this be a one... Why would this one be a job for me? Well, this is your first job, so I figured we'd start with someone easy to handle. Besides, guys like him just end up pissing me off too much. I see. I figured this would be a cinch, but remember, he'll do anything to take it takes to get away. If you slip up, you could get yourself killed. You ready for this? Let's do this. Uh, yeah, I'm ready. Alright, let's go. It's worth the gigolo, I take it. Mm hmm? Uh, is that what is that what they're calling me out here? <sighs> Only thing they're calling you out there is Tetsuya the dead asshole if you don't give me what you owe. Do that and I'm gone. Mm hmm? Oh, you're Miss Tatsu, aren't you? I heard all about you. I was picturing a broad build like a gorilla. And who's this guy? He your pimp? Yeah, and he's ten times better at it than you'll ever be. Mm hmm? When did I become a pimp? <gasps> Zip it. You're here to put the screws on this loser. <laughs> uh, you two done with your little circus act? This meat sack couldn't put the screws on a plank, much less me. You think so? You're about to see what it feels like to get screwed. Mess him up, cutie you. Alright, collect the death. Get over here. Probably could have grabbed another uh, thing off of him. Good work, Kiryu. You see the look on that guy's face? He'll think twice before he gets into any more mischief. Uh, yeah, I hope you're right. You didn't look like a quick learner, though. <laughs> All that just means is you were way too nice to the guy. If it'd be me, well, nice is in my vocabulary. You still have a lot to learn. Let me ask you to help again if something else comes up. Come back when you want to train. Okay. You learned the guarded weapon charge skill. Fists. Nope. Nope. Got a weapon charge skill. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that's what it is. Well, we can learn number two. We also got number three and number four ready to learn. We can unlock 
of the beast. Let me heal up. Let's go again. Ah, Kitty, you ready to go beast mode? Uh, yep, sounds good. It's Tatsu's job. I don't have any jobs for you yet. Keep honing your skills. Do training now for now. All right. Well. Let's go uh, Tenkaichi Street entrance. We'll put away our fish and check up on our businesses. Okay, let's see if there's any factions that are in trouble. Okay, clear, 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 clear. Everybody's clear. We're good to go. Hey. Give me something good. Give me something good. Yeah, okay, I got a bat. Nice. Okay, I think the only plan I have right now is we're going to go to the Maharaja and we're going to invite Riku to dance. Because that's basically all I can think of right now. <laughs> Ranked up nice. Gangan Kasiguze. Okay, let's see what we can buy for 140. I don't think we can buy um camera. I don't think we can buy the pachinko area yet. I think it's 100 and something. Yeah, uh, 140 or 30, 150 something. It's very expensive. Never mind, we can buy it. <laughs> okay, lastly is the shrimp. We have all the properties. Okay, that came out in reverse. Okay, uh, let's check the pawn shop in Don Quixote to see if we can get that uh, 32 level motor. 
if we can get that one more, uh, one level higher motor, we'll be fine. Pretty sure they're not gonna have it, but no, uh, we might as well check. Don Quixote. Nope, no motor. But we can check the other place. I don't think I have any damaged weapons, so we should be fine with what we have for now. Let's sell a couple things. Oh, I have so much. It's 10 million yen. What am I going to do with it? And all I'm going to use it for is whatever I'm going to mess around with for now. Arigato. I don't really need to keep it on me. Fearless pole. Killer B. It's so close to be bought. It's so close. <laughs> I mean, the skin is basically just for like uh, details, right? Because for like just show offiness, right? Adds no real uh, impactfulness to the race. Watch it. They just get electronic nunchucks. Okay, Maharaja should be up the street. Whoa. Got four more throws of the bowling ball. It should be around here. <laughs> Riku. 
いらっしゃいませ Let's invite a friend. Hello, Kiryu san. Shall we dance? <laughs> What a question. <laughs> Uh, it'd be funny if I messed up so much. I'll try hard. Okay, here we go. No. Okay, here we go. Honmono no dance. Nisebu no dance. I messed it up, I pressed the wrong button. We both messed up our fevers, I think. I pressed left instead of right. Thank you for a great time. <laughs> no, thank you. See you again soon. Yes, I'll be waiting. Okay, let's see if we can beat a song on hard. I mean, we technically we won, but let's see if we can get a three star. Honmono no dance. Nisebu dance. Shit. What is that rhythm? It's like quick in the beginning and then it's slow and it takes it drags on at the end. I say like, what the fuck? Let's try it again. Sat it. 
初決めてくるか I don't know. There's sometimes I see it and I'm like, okay, just, a little bit early, a little bit early, a little bit too early, and then I'm fucked. I don't know. <laughs> I feel like some of this timing is fucked up. And also, if you dance into a wall, you can't go back and it'll just pause you. Okay, let's try a different song. I hate that Queen of Passion. Because the, I don't know. Sometimes the, the rhythm's on, on, uh, on the beat, and then it just goes off the melody, and it's like, okay. Let's switch it up. I gotta get better at this. I don't know. I feel like the target lineup is kind of weird, but I don't know if it's just me or if I'm just not used to this. Because <laughs> it feels like I, sometimes I hit it spot on and then it'll just say bad. Take my friend. 
Am I hitting those way too early? What the fuck is this? I hate this system. I really hate this system. It's like, I, I don't know. This system just doesn't work for me. Because I can't tell if I'm on time or if I'm off. Because there's no consistency. Because if I press it just a little bit early, it's just said bad. If you press it just a little bit too late, it just says bad. And it's like... Okay. Maybe I just need to spend more time with this system. I don't know. It just fucking throws me off. I don't like it. <laughs> but it could just be me. <laughs> I don't know why Koi, uh, uh, Doi no Queen or whatever it's called, works pretty well. It's the only one that's clicked so far.
No, I got it. <laughs> I missed one or two of them, I think. Oh, there we go. Okay, let's try again. Maybe I just need to spend more time with this system, I don't know. <laughs> I feel like it's both consistent and inconsistent, but that could just be me. That could just be a me thing. What the heck is that? that it wasn't the worst thing, we at least passed. But the... What the heck? It's like I missed one input and I missed like three different buttons at the same time. What the heck? <laughs> Okay, I think it's fair to say we can open the next dance. I got it. Like I said, I had another peach. Perfect. I'm drinking that one again. Oh, there we go. Shit! Wait. Actually, let's buy Ayaka. Hello, it's good to see you again. Shall we dance? <laughs> sure, I love dancing. Oh, she's about to die. Okay, here we go. Unless she's really good at dancing, then I'm gonna be worried. Sate. <laughs> Ha! 
I clearly won. <laughs> I really enjoyed dancing with you. Will I see you again soon? <laughs> sure thing. I'll give you a call. Don't make me wait too long. Hi. Alright. I think that's enough dancing for now. Our money should be ready to collect now. We set the carpets on fire and we should be ready to go. It's not carpets, it's more like disco lights, translucent floors. All right. Okay, we're about to take the Electronic King's area. Oh, wait, let's see if we have any fights. Yep, Electronic King, Pleasure King, all three of them. All right. What, do you want me to rob you? What the heck? Nicholas Cage? <laughs> no, it's not Nicholas Cage. <laughs> yeah, let's go. Take down the Gambling King, then we take down the Pleasure, uh, the Electronics King, and then finally the Pleasure King. Take a cab back to our area.
explosion. Begin his luck. Okay, now the Electronic King. Okay, the Gambling King bar should fill up all the way now. for the full combo. Damn. Too bad. <laughs> Only made a little less than a million yen off of that. Okay, Electronic King. I should send it all the way to 99 now. If anything. And after that, we can just buy all of his stuff. And max it out. Come on, lackeys. on the ground. I want this trash can. Bam. <laughs> Got an untouchable for that one. Okay. So this is you. Now we do the Pleasure King. Okay, how much CP did I get out of the, all that dancing? I got in a decent amount. Maybe enough to do absolutely nothing with. Oh, man. We got the feng shui almost ready to go. Get a golden pistol. Damn. You gotta go fat. Now oh, the Pleasure King's area. Somebody's getting robbed. Somebody's getting robbed. We're just completely ignoring them because their safety and well-being is not up to me. It's up to the streets of Kamurocho. Okay. These men are causing problems. And I skipped through the entire dog dialogue situation. Well, I had to listen to the stupid <laughs> sign-up thing again. Absolutely nothing. <laughs> drop kick. <laughs> I was hoping I was actually going to get the drop kick. A little circle like that sometimes doesn't always work out, pan out for me. We know it'll solve the problem. All I have to do is wait for the prophet to come turning back. On. 
Okay, let's see. What should I do for now? I mean, I can try and probably... Oh, oh, oh. he dodged into me. Idiot. Okay. I mean, I could probably use a couple... I could... I, I've caught some fish. I'll just cook up, cook me up some fish. Take one of these gubbies that I have. Right. Can I put one back? Oh, I just take all three, I guess. All right, let's cook one of these gubbies up. Excuse me, excuse me. I am not that far ahead. Okay. Oh, right. I almost ran past it. Let's give him a fish. Perfect. Nothing fresher than the fish I've caught with my own hands. I guess we can put the rest back. Get back to collecting. It looks like the end machine's been used up for now. Oh, sorry. I mean, the only thing I can think of now doing is doing the phone telephone thing again. What's this? Uh, oh, Mr. President, I'm so I'm sorry. Could you get the phone? Uh, sure. Much, much. Greetings, Kitty Yakun. Hmm. That voice. The electronics king. What do you want? Are you free? I. What was his voice again? I love to hang out and play a game with you. Mm. Again? Games are so much fun when you're playing against someone. Come on, humor me. I'm at my base, okay? I'll be waiting. That was definitely not his voice. Was that by any chance the Electronics King? Uh, yeah. He wants, he's, he wants me to play a game with him. Mm. I wonder what that means. Please be careful. Uh, yeah. What's he mean by game? I've got a bad feeling about this. Better make sure I'm ready before heading out. Okay, well, let's save. Do we have a couple of healing stuff? Do we have a couple of heat stuff? Let's save. We have close to no money, so let's see what the electric king wants. The electronic king. He wants to meet at the arcade. Am I going to have to beat him in a game of Outrun? Thirty thousand is pretty much okay. Going in with no money. 
if pocket change compared to the electronics key. Okay. Hi, Kiryu-kun. Thanks for coming by. Shall we get started? Start what? <laughs> A fighting game, of course. It's got this radical action-packed PvP mode. <laughs> we did in an actual fight? I'm better at fighting in real life than in video games, so that sounds perfect. Are we going to bet anything this time? Mm. Yes, huh? let's bet. All the properties that you and I own. Here's the deal. If you win, I give you all the properties in this area. Log off the grid. If you lose, you give me all of your properties. It's not fair. Just one catch. There's no guarantee that you'll still be alive if you lose. I mean, I look like much, but I'm strong. That's fine by me. I have no intention of losing either. <laughs> you'll regret this. Oh, just surround me, why don't you? What, you're not doing this one-on-one? -on -one? <sighs> that's not how I... That's how I would have preferred it, but unfortunately... I really have to make sure I win this time. You've put me in a tight spot, you see. I never calculated that I, a super gamer with an IQ of 190, would be put up against a wall by some too big gangster. Maybe I just don't have some business acumen. Uh, yeah, I agree. Well, it's really annoying when someone else says it. Well, anyway, thanks for stealing my area. It was fun. Do you know, you kind of went too far. I'm gonna have to kill you to get it back. Uh -huh. Remember, if you die in this game, you die in real life. Let's see if you can survive. Can we just take, take it outside the arcade? I needed this space.
Alaska is a little bit tougher than I expected him to be. This is a terrible place for us to fight. Uh, you've got some powerful specs there, Kitty Yukun. What another round? Yeah. No, I've had enough. You win. I'm out. So right now, I'm pulling out of this area in Kamarucho's money game. You all right with that? Yeah, I've lost in business and got beat fighting too. It really doesn't make sense for me to go on. Even if I did, you'll just continue to get better than me. All I did was grind for money to purchase more properties, but you deserve it. He devised a tactic to level up your businesses by micromanaging the time and resources you had available. <laughs> in video games, the player who comes up with his own unique strategy can even beat the most practiced players. Your play style evolved as you win, and it's only natural you'd win. Yeah. I don't think I did anything out of the ordinary. I just w did what I could. <laughs> well, still got beat. I set a financial high score by investing in tech stocks. Then I got into this money game. The people who'd called me a nerd came to fear me as one of the five billionaires. I tried a lot of new things, but to tell you the truth, I'd rather play games in an arcade than sit around making billions of yen. I think I'm more suited to being a gamer than a billionaire. I see. Kitty Kun, let's play again sometime. But next time, no betting. Yeah, I'm not motivated to play when there's nothing on the line. So how about betting on who pays for dinner? <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like fun. I've learned my lesson now that I have zero talent of running a business. I'll go back to being a gamer. And you know, I'd still love to help you out. He's a security person? What the f- I'm your maiden? Oh no. I wish I could do more to help you, but I can't afford to be seen doing that. I need to lay low for a bit. What is that? Oh, oh, uh, you're better off not knowing. Let's just say I betrayed the five billionaires, so now friendly fire is activated. You can probably imagine what kind of danger a trader like me would be up against. You watch yourself too, Kiryu Kun. Uh, right. Blocks. I can learn how to block. Is that the first skill I learned? I hope it is. Thanks. Bean the punch. Quick step blow. I actually need to lock, unlock a lot more stuff for a rush. Oh no, this is probably where I learned it. Probably. Okay, go back to collect the money. Upgrade all the areas.
I know it's... Oh, wait, what? What, what? What is hmm? this? Is that the telephone? Yes, hello? Oh, our president. Please hold on a moment. Mr. President, someone named Mario-san is asking for you. Mario? I don't really know anyone by that name. Marui? Hello? Hello, are you Kiryu-san, the president? Uh, yes, and who might you be? I'm with the Criminal Investigation Department of the Original Taxation Bureau. Nani, a tax inspector. Yes, are you familiar with us? All I know is that investigators from the Regional Taxation Bureau do all kinds of things about the tax cheats who can be caught by normal audits. Yes, we go by Marusa. We're surprised you've heard of us. So what does Marusa want with me? I'd love to have a chat with you, Kiryu-san. I'm thinking about dropping by in the near future. What do you mean, what do you mean by chat? I'll discuss things in more detail when we meet. Oh, and I have my hair in a bob. Please remember that so you can spot me when I visit. Tax investigator for Marusa? What'd she want with me? Tax lady? Oh god. We get taxes involved. What's the matter, Mr. President? Are you okay? Uh, yeah. No problems here. At any rate, a woman with a bobbed haircut is going to come from the Regional Taxation Bureau. Guess I'll find out what she wants when I talk to her. Take a camera. Oh, now we pull the controller's area, so we don't need to. ジェリンジェリン稼ぐぜ。ガンガン稼ぐぜ。儲かった。上等だ。これで通だ。これで通だ。これで通だ。死の木切ったな。まあ、こんなところか。マネーゲーム開始だ。資金投入だ。why does he look upset? I mean, I know why he looks upset, but why does he look upset? Oh, I started collecting on this one. Oh no, I haven't collected on this one. Have I? Better than anything. Tanum does it. Oh, my, my cassette. Jerin, Jerin, Cassette. He's not the worst situation. Come out with enough uh, extra money to buy another place in the Pleasure Kings area. But it could be this way, it could be that way. Okay, Pachinko 
Hey, there we go. All right, let's do the telephone game. Then, I, then I think we'll rest for that. I see if we get any daytime uh, quests. Hmm. Hmm? That can't be herb, can it? What's that odd-looking woman doing? Is she checking out the office? But to think of it, there was that call. The woman with bobbed hair is coming for the Regional Taxation Bureau. So, that woman must be from the investigation department, Marusa. Little taxation experts that investigate companies for tax evasion. She's one of them. Hmm. Oi. Hey, are you maybe? Hmm? What is it? Are you, uh, Marusa? Marusa? What do you mean by Marusa? Yeah. Well, you have a bob haircut. You must be the woman who called me, aren't you? Huh? What are you saying? I'm not Marusa. My name's kind of close, but... I'm hungry. What? what? I'm the one from Marusa, Kiryu-san. What? Eh? Yes. Sorry for not introducing myself earlier. I'm Agent Marui of the ta Regional Taxation Bureau's Criminal Investigation Department, a.k.a. Marusa. So, you're the one who called me. You wanted to talk to me about something? Yes, I was hoping to ask you something, Kiryu-san. What's that? Kiryu-san, I need your assistance in a delicate matter. What kind of assistance? You mean Marusa needs help? Precisely. Kiryu-san, have you had any dealings with your neighbor... Maguro Enterprises in the office next door? Yeah. No, I didn't know the name of the business until now. Good. That's ideal. We're investigating Maguro Enterprises for tax evasion. Really? Tax evasion? Keep it down. We were tipped off on Maguro's infection by an informant who was dealing with him. Our soul promised... Our source promised to deliver evidence to back it up, but then we lost all contact. Mm. The source must have been silent forever. I'm afraid so. I need to get the goods on Maguro Enterprises, but if I did it myself, Maguro might notice a stranger sniffing around and become suspicious. But if you were seen with me, his next door neighbor, your presence can be explained. That's why you want my help with this? It's, I couldn't put it better. Catch on fast. Yeah, I get the picture, but I don't really have much of a stake in this. Nope, you're not obliged in any way. But if you were to offer assistance, you won't regret it. In more ways than one would think. What's that supposed to mean? You're taking on the five billionaires, right? That's on top of figuring out how to run a business. Not too easy for you, is it? How do you know that? <laughs> I'm with Marisa, remember? It's nothing compared to the kind of inform information we work with. Here's the deal. Help me, and I'll help you with your business. Not a bad deal, is it? You're serious. Yep, I know the industry inside and out. My supports have been valuable, wouldn't you say? Mm, true. So, decision time. Will you help me investigate Maguro Enterprises quietly? Uh, fine. Tax evasion is a serious crime. I'll do my part for the good of society. <laughs> good. We have a deal. Hey, Maruso lady? Yes, Kiryu-san? By the way, I told you my name is Marui. Uh, Marui-san, you're, uh, kind of close. <laughs> it's a brilliant cover, though. By pretending to be a couple, we can loiter without arousing suspicion. Uh, alright. Uh, uh. Hmm? What's the matter? What's the matter with Marui-san? Shh. Wait, it's Maguro. The head honcho from Maguro Enterprises is coming. Hmm? Uh. Hey, he's staring at us. It's okay. We just we're just a couple on a date. Mm. Yes, bud. 
<sighs> Just go with it. Kitty, son, I love you. Huh? It, what gives all? What gives all of a sudden? I don't love her. Play along, will you? We have to convince them we're a couple in love. Come on, Kitty, son, you need to perform. Perform. Clearly, <laughs> love. Marie, son, I can't resist. I love you. Look at Kitty, son. Me too. I love you. Yes, me too. I love you so much. I can't resist. <laughs> I, I can't resist either. My love for you is greater than the stars that I have. <laughs> what the fuck is this? What is going on? What the? Whoa! whoa. <laughs> I'm sorry. You, you will woke the woman in me. What? Mm. Why does this always seem to happen to me? Wait. What about Marguerite? Get her, Mudo. Yes, it worked. Good job, Kiryu san. Hmm? Uh, wait a second, you're. Uh oh, does he suspect something? Yeah, you're from the office next door, aren't you? I've seen you going in and out. Uh, uh, yeah. I'm Kiryu. I was recently put in charge here. Sorry for not introdu introducing myself earlier. Oh, I'm Maguro. I'm in real estate. And no, I should have introduced myself sooner, too. <laughs> anyway, Kiryu-san. I'm impressed you're the man in charge at such a young age. Must bring a lot to the table. Yeah. No, it really, it was really just circumstantial. <laughs> and modest too. Listen, may I invite you to my office for some tea? I'd like to get to know my neighbor. Nani? Huh? Oh, wait. I shouldn't be interrupting your fun. Sorry. That was inconsiderate of me. Interrupting your fun? Oh. President Maguro, please pay me no heed. I'm President Kiryu's secretary, after all. Hmm? What? Kiryu-san, you're dating your own secretary? That must be nice. <laughs> now I really want to get to know you better, Kiryu-san. Please, do come for a visit. Mm. Oh, please, Marina. Don't come out. I don't know. Kiryu-san, this is the perfect opportunity. Huh? We've got to gain entry into Maguro Enterprises. I knew you were the right man for the job, Kiryu-san. Oh, right. That's true. But what if our, what, but what if our coverage blown? Danger comes with the territory. I'll do whatever it takes to expose Maguro's shady dealings. Got it. I'm in, in this with you to the end. Is something the matter? Yeah. No, no, we were just saying we should take you up on your kind offer and visit your office. I see, I see. Then, please, this way. This voice is gonna hurt. <laughs> Oops, there's no one here. The staff and even my secretary are out. No matter, I can prepare the tea myself. Have a seat and make yourself comfortable. <laughs> I like it hot and steamy. Okay, hot and steamy it shall be. He honestly seems like a nice guy so far. This is our chance to search the office. Oi, are you sure about this, Marie san? There's no telling when Maguro Ma will come back. Kitty san, tell me. What is he, what's he doing now? Making our tea. A standard teapot's capacity is between 400 to 600 milliliters. To prepare tea for three or some refills, you would need two pots. So he needs to boil a liter of water. To boil a liter of water in a kettle takes about four minutes on high heat. That man likely gets his secretary to make tea. So he need time finding the tea leaves. All in all, we have about seven minutes to conduct a search before he returns with our tea. Follow? Maru says something else. This isn't so much Marisa as it's just common sense. Also, rather than waking those gums, how about getting busy? I doubt financial statements will mean anything to you, Kiryu san. Look for anything suspicious instead. Uh, got it. Okay, if we're gonna check something. A daughter in a branching stallion. The man's got taste. 
This video rack, is there something odd about it? What's odd about it? It's location. Oi, Marisa, take a look at this video rack. Don't you think it's in a weird place? <laughs> Pardon? Where the video rack's located? Mm. Mm. It doesn't look at a place to me. What about it struck you as odd? Yeah. No, I guess I got carried away. Okay, but that kind of instinct can be invaluable if something bugs you. Check it thoroughly. It is weird that he has this right here. Because there's not a TV here. Okay. Something's wrong. It's a presence. Oi, Marisa, don't you think this video rack is odd? <laughs> odd? I don't see anything odd about it. There's nothing wrong with the video rack itself, but it's strange that it's here in this room at, at all. Being here is odd. Oh. oh, you're right. There's all these videos, but neither a TV nor a VCR to play them on. Ah, uh, right. It's too bulky to be just placed here on a temporary basis. Besides, there's dust here that shows it hasn't been moved recently. There's something clearly unnatural about this video rack. Kitty <laughs> son, that's on the money. They must be hiding something in these videotapes. I think he would hide evidence in plain sight in his office. Magura's bold, I'll give him that. So, if you were to examine these videotapes. Kitty son, sorry, but could you open the door for me? I'm holding a tray. Uh, uh sure, I'll get it. He was quicker than expected. What do we do? You know where to look now, so maybe we, we should come back another time? Mm -hmm. No, I can't risk having you move the evidence. We're settling this now. Yeah, yeah, but Maguro's back. We can't keep searching. True, I don't have any choice. It's time for the last resort. Mm -hmm. Last resort? <laughs> Sorry to keep you folks waiting. I usually get my secretary to serve deep. So I had to track down the tea leaves. Yeah. Uh, thank you very much. Speaking of, why isn't your secretary taking a seat? <laughs> oh, I'm sorry for any awkwardness. I threw out my back and sitting is simply agonizing. <laughs> Ouch, that's rough. I know how bad it is to throw out your back. Yes, I, so I would prefer, much prefer to stand. Please don't mind me. Remember what I just told you, kitty san Keep Maguro focused on while I examine all the video cassettes. There's no way to, this is going to work. You should, sure to notice. You can do it, Kiryu san. You're a man with the balls to do this. And Marcy gets men by their balls. That made no sense. That's wrong. Can't take your eyes off each other. Oh. Oh, oh no, it's nothing. <laughs> ah, it must be nice to be in love like that. Anyway, Kiryu san, if you don't mind me asking, how did you get to be in charge of your own office at such a young age? Uh. Well, it's a little complicated. I was approached by this man. Pachi's scrambling. Well, my son's got nerves of steel. If Maguro were to glance behind him, he'd be, we'd be toast. Oh, I see. It's amazing how a single chance meeting can change your life completely, isn't it? Hmm? You seem a little distracted, Kitty or something. Is something bothering you? Nani? Huh? Uh, you think so? It's just... Something seems to be distracting you a lot. What's bothering you? Your clothes just look really great, Maguro son. Hmm? What? My clothes, you say? <laughs> so you can tell, can you? I bought these on an impulse just the other day. Cost a fair amount, too. Around 800,000 or so. It's a great brand, and the design is a big name worldwide. You have to add it to their sense of style, I mean. You can tell it's a quality piece by. She is scrambling, holy shit. I managed to get through that. Oh, it's not just clothes for me either. I have a collection of watches too. Well, they're at home, of course, but the German made timepieces. Maguro liked the sound of his own voice. We have to keep Maguro talking by some time so Maruri can finish going through the videotapes. 
kidding aside. I have to tell you, I'm impressed by how well your business is doing. Yeah. Oh, I don't think we're doing anything too differently. <laughs> how about a stuff you? I wish your success would rub off on us next door. The world being the way it is, the one with the money wins. It doesn't matter how they get it. I've got neither. It doesn't matter at all. Hmm? Oh, excuse me. Got lost in my own thoughts there. Tell me, Kitty Osan. You're obviously well off, but is there anything you still want? Hmm. Something I want. Let's see. House, maybe. A house, maybe. Oh, a house, you say. What sort of property are you considering? Hmm? I got really perked up there. All right, of course, you're in real estate. <laughs> you forgot that. Comprehensive support for finding a dream property. You get it all at Maguro Enterprises. So, what areas are you considering for your new home? Do you want a single family home or a condo? How much floor space would you like? Well, let's see. There, I kept Maguro's attention focused on me. Maori's son, hurry. <laughs> well, I must say I'm glad I finally got to meet you, Kirio san. I enjoyed chatting with you, too. Uh, uh, yeah. Same here. I'm trying to wrap things up. Is Maori done? She wants more time. Oh, boy. Easy for her to say. Well, Kirio san, I enjoyed your visit, but I should be getting back to work now. Maguro san. Hmm? Yes. How do I buy more time? Ooh, <laughs> that'll end things pretty quickly. Uh. Uh. Let's read Maguro's palm. Actually, palmistry is a hobby of mine. May I do a reading, Maguro san? You want to do a palm reading on me? Uh, yes, Maguro-san, a person of your stature is sure to have a very distinctive and unique palm features. Uh, can we wait until next time? I actually have a meeting coming up. No, it has to be now. No, all right. Your palm, it has all the markings of a great luck involving money. Ah, really? That's great. I hope my business will really take off. Mm. This line. Now this is intriguing. Hmm? Oh, Kiryu san, what do you mean? Can you explain. She's still scrambling. Good, I bought her some more time. Well, Kiryu san, thanks for visiting. Feel free to drop by anytime for some tea. Uh. Uh, yeah. There, got it. This is it. Hmm? What? President Magro, I found this bank book in the videotape. Interesting, these numbers don't seem to match the revenue figures in your tax filing. <laughs> what? That's you. Are you from Marusa? I was merely invited along as Kiryu-san's friend, but yes, coincidentally, I happened to work for the Criminal Investigation Department of the Regional Taxation Bureau. I'd r I'm rather dismayed that I stumbled upon evidence of your tax evasion on my private time. Uh -huh. Damn you. I'll kill you. You want to consider the consequences first? Uh. If you kill me, you're guaranteed a life sentence. Stay on your best behavior and you might be lucky enough to get parole in 30 years. How old will you be then? If you're willing to stay caged that long, then go ahead. Kill me. Uh. Oh, he's groveling. Okay. That was a little bit of strain on my voice. <laughs> Kiryu-san, thanks to you, we got evidence of Maguro's tax evasion. You did a great job keeping Maguro's attention away from me. You did better than I could have hoped. <laughs> Just doing my part for the country. Like a pro, like I promised, I'll help you with your business, of course. I will expect to be compensated fairly. Nani, what? It's not free? <laughs> of course not. Besides, it's peanuts to you. In this day and age, 
money is flowing like water. Mm. I feel like I got the short end of this stick. Advisor. And, Kiryu-san, make sure your office keeps on filing the taxes properly, got it? Uh, no argument for me. I just got a first-hand demonstration of how scary Marusa can be. <laughs> you know it. Crime doesn't pay. This is for you as thanks for your help. I want you to have it. You got a trouble finder. Watch your back. Marusa looks everywhere. Sniff around. Eh, sniffing around wherever dirty money leaves a stench. You never know. Marusa could be watching you out of sight, but never far away. Oh, what the fuck? What the? Is that... Is that creepy girl the one that's watching us? Okay, well... I guess that's okay. Oh, sorry, man. Well, that was a whole situation. I think we can continue our collecting, I guess. My throat really hurts, man. Everybody's ready to pay out. ボロモ。ボロモ。儲かった。上等だ。資金投入だ。これでどうだ。資金投入だ。なんかこれ<笑> No money battle. Yeah, she is actually pretty good. Let's buy some Pleasure Kings area. <clears throat> Wait. Yeah, let's buy one property from the Pleasure King and then uh, we head to bed. Starting tomorrow, we'll do interviews. I need to sleep for the night. Let's see where. Okay, this is Namakichi Street. And. This is the pass between. Okay, and we have Pleasant Street. Is this viable? Nope.
Did he lose me pretty quickly? Okay, that's funny. I know. Um, excuse me, please. I need help. My drunk prayer is harassing my friend. Please, please come help her. Okay, what's up? <sighs> All right, where is she? But thank you. Over here. Oh, quick. Well, you could have waited for me, but uh, I guess we'll just get ditch done. Okay. They're just through here. She's setting me up. I'm get robbed. And there's drunks all alone. Does he have any friends? Where'd she go? Nanny. He's just trying to hit me. Shit. What's going on here? Nice dodge. Not bad for a shitty Yakuza. I was told there'd be a drunk pervert. <laughs> You're too gullible, asshole. <laughs> Who cares? So that girl's your accomplice. What do you want from me? I just have a small favor to ask. <laughs> do society a favor and die. Interesting. Don't kill me. You set up an ambush and then beg for mercy. Not the sharpest tool in the shed, are you? Let's see your face. Uh. Just a kid. So, what's your story? Did someone pay you to kill me? No, it isn't like that. Huh? Then why'd you target me? You're on, you on the Dojima pay, family payroll? The, the Dojima family? I, I don't know what you're talking about. I don't know any Dojima family. I didn't care who I was, as long as it was a Yakuza. I didn't even have, it didn't even have to be you. Nani, what? <sighs> I hate Yakuza. It'd be better world if they'd all die. <laughs> people who are fond of the Yakuza are pretty rare, but it, I'd say it's even rare to find a nut job waiting to jump people in the back alley for no damn reason. How old are you? I'm 16. Mm. High school, then. Screw high school. I'm in a biker gang. <laughs> so you're some biker gang grunt? Huh? What makes you think I'm a grunt? Yeah. Right. What's your name? Tanaka. Shinji Tanaka. Shinji Tanaka. And what's your deal? What family are you with? I'm a civilian, not a Yakuza. Yeah, right. I'll ask one more time, Shinji. Nobody put you up to this. Ah, huh. that's right. Then why'd you do it? The Yakuza destroyed my family. My old man ran into cash. Blow trouble. Find. Flipping real estate. The Yakuza sharks smelled blood in the water and they took everything. My mom was smart. She ran at the first sight of trouble. Those assholes came and beat on my old man every day. Then the old man would beat on me because he could. <sighs> but that stopped once I hit him back. Now he sits around hugging a bottle. Makes me want to put him out of his misery. I couldn't stand being around him. So I hit the streets. And you thought mugging a Yakuza was the answer? If I'm gonna steal to live, Yakuza are all totally fair game. But they're all thieves anyway. They've got reputations to uphold. They can't go crying to the cops if they get their asses kicked. Huh. 
Walking to find life, they catch you, they'll kill you without a second thought. <laughs> it's fine. The only one who knows I'm doing this on my bike gang. Guys I can trust. Hope that works out for you. Hey, where do you think you're going? What, you need me to listen to more of your life story? As long as you're not answering to a higher power, I'm done with you. Since you're letting me speak my mind, quit this Yakuza hunting thing while you're ahead. You're still alive through dumb luck. When they catch you, and they will, they'll pay you back tenfold. Whatever. I haven't met a Yakuza as tough as you yet. As long as they're alone, they go down like chumps. I enjoy listening to them beg for mercy. I said, when you kicked my ass, I seriously thought I was dead. Fine. You do what you want. Not gonna argue about it. You're the grown man. That kid's gonna be dead sooner or later. But what? I did what I could. I got my own properties. I got my own problems right now. I got my own properties. It was what I was gonna go for. <laughs> oh, sorry. I'm pretty sure North Pink Street is not viable for anything. Oh, that's karaoke. Okay. Is this viable? Actually, where's the property area for this specific area? Oh yeah, I went too far. <laughs> oh, I'm in the wrong area. Right? No, I'm in the right area. I think I can buy something for 90 something. Give me that motor. I was just kidding. <laughs> I was just kidding about the motor. <laughs> oh god. I was just kidding about the motor. <laughs> Oh god. <laughs> I was seriously kidding about the motor. I didn't need it, right? <laughs> 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 I was kidding about the motor. <laughs> we have two more places. Moscow Western Cuisine. <laughs> I think the game is trying to tell you something. Probably. <laughs> Alright, these guys need to stop kissing right now. Oh, uh, I screwed up. What's wrong? You seem a little... Down. Oh, oh, hey. Well, I went to a no-touching bikini bar, and I reached out and touched the dancer. So, you got kicked out? I just couldn't help <sighs> myself. I guess self-control isn't one of your strengths. Anyway, are you getting any lately? That's not what I'm here for. Not everyone's like you. You kidding? Well, then what are you doing in Kamurocho, the land of sexy ladies? Nani, is it? Duh! Let's see. For example, there's a girl who calls the telephone club who sounds really flirty. Would do anything for a date with a girl like her. Mm. 
Maybe. I'll look for her if I feel like it. <laughs> what did I give to get my hands on a video of a girl like her? I'll keep it under lock and key and treasure it forever. Ever and ever. Whoa. Okay, I need to sleep. Turn it to daytime. Maybe some daytime missions will happen. I don't know. I feel like it's a thing that could happen. I never really spent that much time just, like sleeping. Because it looks like there's a day night cycle kind of thing going on. So I'm pretty sure it leads to the limits of the day cycle. You need to play pocket racer. It's what it's telling me, but I don't have a good enough uh, setup yet. I need a stronger. Well, I have what I need now, which is the motor that I was hoping for, but it's too strong of a motor now. She's gonna make things fall off. I mean, I can make it heavy as fuck, and then see if that'll hold on. Okay, neither of the end machines are working. Wait, where do I sleep? Where's my bed? I don't know where to sleep. I want to turn it to daytime. Where do I sleep? Where is my bed? I don't know where to sleep. Where is my bed? I mean, I guess I can try and do pocket racing. What's going on here? Oh, is it just the exit cutscene? Oi! Hey, you! Mm. Talking to me? You see anybody else? Come with us. We need to have a little chat. Who are you guys? Doesn't matter who we are, but you, on the other hand, you know a kid named Shinji Tanaka? Mm -hmm. He told us all about you. You don't need to spell it out for us, do you? Yeah. I have no idea what you're talking about. Uh -huh. Don't play dumb with me. He used that kid to go after our boys. Nani, what? The kid ratted you out. So quit playing dumb and come along. This is what happens when you screw with the Jinsai family. You guys got Shinji? What did you do with him? <laughs> <laughs> Your concern for that little shit is real touching. It's as good as side confession. You're the guy he's working for. But don't worry about a thing. You'll see him real soon. So quit dragging your ass and come with us. <laughs> no wonder the Jinsai family is a shit stand of a third string family. You guys don't know anything about etiquette. Uh huh? Huh? You want to take me somewhere? You better bow first. If you can't do that, then piss off. Why, you fucking punk? Forget it. We'll beat the shit out of you here and now.
spam. Yeah. Who the hell is this guy? This is crazy. Where's Shinji? That punk better still be alive. Show me where he is. You ought to know. Another guy pulling his strings. He lied to you. <clears throat> what? He dragged me into this and he's going to pay for it. Oh, I, I see. So that's how it is. This went down. <laughs> We're on the same page though, man. Huh? Then take me to him now. Quit stalling. Y yes, sir. It's better to find a kid good like this Malinga boys. So, where's the guy filling his punk head with ideas? Still can't find him. <laughs> you, you did come for me. They're taking a nap outside. You sure pulled out all the stops to deal with one stupid kid. What circus? Huh? What? You're shitting me. Kiryu-san. Why would a dead man invite this kind of shit? Like it bother hunting down weaklings like you. Shinji, you shoved a load of BS down your throats. <laughs> Whoa, that's the story. Well, screw it. I better give a... I don't give a shit anymore. It's a lucky day. All we gotta do is take this clown to Dojima family. We're heading to the good graces of the most powerful family in Kamarucho. <sighs> All right. Cave his face in. He's our ticket to the big leagues. And he's out. Damn, you are freakishly tough. So you're Kiryu, Kazuma Kiryu. I heard about you. Odojima's family's out hunting for you. That's brutal, man. You're taking out the whole Dojima family by yourself? I wish I had a, half that kind of strength. They worked you over pretty good. Did that pound some sense into that thick skull of yours? As if. How did they find out you were the one going after them? Someone in the gang r ratted me out. They got scared that Yakuza would come after them. If my cover got blown. So they turned me over in exchange for their safety. Mm. Huh. When I think about it, I can see why they did it. I was an idiot for trusting them. One more question. Why did you tell those goons that I was the one ordering you to go on this Yakuza beating spree? Yeah. Because if I didn't give them something, these guys were going to take me out and bury me out, bury me off in the mountains. I figured there's no way they could take you on. So I gave them a description. I told them that you were my boss. I had to. I thought maybe you'd come save me. You just seem like that kind of guy. What the hell? What do you think you're doing? And what have you been doing with your whole life? 
The gun's to your head, and the first guy who comes to mind is a complete stranger you've only met once. No family, friends, or relatives you could trust to throw out there. Instead, you've only been acting like some vigilant jackass, trying to take out the Yakuza until they finally won. What the hell is this kind of life? Nobody ever taught me to trust. I never had anyone around to show me what to do. So I figure it out as I went. No one taught me anything about how to live. <laughs> Grow up. You can't blame this shit on your father or the people who failed you. You have to fight your own, your own damn battles. I'm no exception. I'm trying my damn hardest to live. But you're so damn strong. I was just lucky. I had a mentor. I did, I did have someone who gave me something I could aspire to be. He's a Yakuza, though. So I guess that means you automatically hate him. Is he a role model? He's Shintaro Kazuma, the captain of the Dojima family. If I could be half the man he is, I'd be alright. But I'm not even close to that. Shinji, the Yakuza have their eyes on you now. You can't stick around. Get out of Kamarucho, find yourself someone you can trust. Someone to show you the ropes. Get out of Kamarucho? I can't do that, Kiryu-san. I'm not running away. Nani, what? Besides, you've got way more Yakuza on your tail than I do, don't you? I'm staying put. <laughs> Have it your way. That's how you choose to live? Like I said before, I won't argue with you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's my decision. Promise me this, though. Cut ties with your sorry little gang. And, if you're going to live in this town, I want you to figure out how to outlive me, Shinji. Hey, Kiryu-san, one last thing. What made you come save me? You're already at the top of the Dejima family's hit list. Why take that risk? Who knows? I don't know why I do half the things I do. But when I was a kid, I was alone too. If I hadn't met Kazuma-san, I'd probably be a lot like you are now. See you around, Shinji. Kiryu-san, I think I've found someone I can aspire to be. In fact, I hope someday I can be even better than you. No matter where you go, I'm going to be just a step behind. You just watch. Kiryu-san, sir. I got called sir. <laughs> okay, I actually need to switch out my phone. My phone's dying. <laughs> so I'll be right back. Hey, back again. Okay. Okay, I think we should do pocket racing. 
think the game is telling you about it. <laughs> well, now that we have the motor, I think for now we can settle with the gears as they are. Like, just go uh, go down and peg for the gears and just concentrate on the motor. Am I headed the right direction? No, I went too far. Just keep going straight. What? What? Sorry. For the situation that we have now, concentrate on the motor and forego the gear. And then we just weigh it down as much as we can. Let me see how we do. Because the high tor torque motor already does pretty well. The gear right now is too much. Actually. Okay, actually, this works out pretty well for me. Customized. Damn it. Take a test run. We have to get under 220, 215. With just this motor. Yeah, we need one less tier of gear. <laughs> the gear is too strong. Right, let's try the motor again. Soft tires should give us a little bit more grip. And we fell out again. Okay, the motor is not the problem. That is so terribly slow.
It has a decent amount of speed, which I appreciate. And we're out again. <laughs> this motor is too powerful. <laughs> we already bought everything for the store. Damn it. Oh. Uh, Master Makoon, I was waiting for you. Are you ready? Are you ready? Yeah. I don't even know what car we're supposed to be racing or what race we're actually doing. Well, actually, let's just see if we can start the race and customize it. We got the combination, probably. Okay, let's try it out. Cool, I just don't go slow just because I'm a kid. Oh god, that's a lot of heals. I am too powerful. <laughs> Tires. Go. Bike tires. Full frame plus motor. Gears. It's too, too, it's still too strong. <laughs> We're still too strong. <laughs> We're one level too strong. This course is not one level too strong. Could this be enough? Less than a minute. I don't know. I might lose this one. Kazuma-kun,挑むのは最近実力を伸ばしていると評判の秀樹君だ。注目のカズマ君は青レーンだ。対するは秀樹君だ。みんな一律け。Yeah. Oh god. I am done for. Yeah. I'm fucking ended. This man's about to lap me here in a bit. Three, two, one, lap. Oh, okay, never mind. I'm still being lapped. I had to dumb down my RC to his fucking Yeah, that's to be expected. I could have dumbed down to his level. Yay, I win! Did you see that? M Mika chan, I won! Hmm, Kazuma Kun's car looked like it could go a lot faster. Maybe it wasn't running very well this time. Kazuma Kun, you should go work on your car and try again. You give Kazuma Kun a rematch, won't you, Hideki Kun? What? Okay. Whatever. I'll accept your challenge anytime. What the? Let's customize. Let's just do a test run. I keep it under twenty. Oh, 
Oh, was that what is holding me back? <laughs> I did side switch in this shit. <laughs> okay, let's see if we can get on to a minute. I think I'm 56. Gotta go faster. Could it be done? <laughs> Oh god! <laughs> it was too overdone. <laughs> Actually, see how it does with the balance. Board. His speed is already noticeable. Seconds, two more laps. Two, three, four, five, six. That's not bad. Plus slicks. What happens if I add speed? Pretty good. Cornering seems pretty well. Running pretty okay. Gonna get 29. 35 and 6. 40. Going up two slopes, kind of. 
Let's see how this does. We're sitting at 54 right now. How are you? regular flip. Okay, speed is fair. Nothing to write about. Let's see, 30 seconds up 5. Let's try this one and see how it does. I'm sitting at 54, so we might be able to do this. Yeah, let's race. This should work. Let's race.頼んだぜ。俺の豪烈な手が。カズマ君が挑むのは最近実力を伸ばしていると評判のヒデキ君だ。注目のカズマ君は青レーンだ。対するはヒデキ君だ。それではレースを開始するぜ。ああ、ショ
racing with Taka Makun and my other buddies. That's why I got so slow. Could be. Pocket Circuit races get better by competing and learning from it. So how about racing with Taka Makun again? Ah, yep. I'm gonna practice lots more with Taka Makun and my other friends. Compete with them and get super duper fast. And... I'm going to win Mika-chan over. <laughs> like your guts. Go for it, little dude. Ah, yep. I want to race you again. Too, kazuma -kun. Hey, Takuma, let's go practice. Ah. Huh? Uh, sure. <laughs> that worked out, I guess. At least these kids have patched things up. Oh, no. kazuma -kun. Hmm? You were so fast and so cool. My heart was thumping just watching you. Ouch. Oh, great. Thanks. You really are cool. Maybe I can even be your girlfriend. Nanny, what? Girlfriend? Uh, but I don't want someone who's slower than me. That's why we should race. If you win. If I win? I'll be your girlfriend. <laughs> no, wait, I... Okay, bye. If you want to raise me, I'll be right here. Boy, I got dragged into another mess, even for kids, where I'm at Sherry's one tough obstacle course. Oh, God. <laughs> onyo. That is a big onyo. I need more in stock. What the heck? Okay, let's take a test run. We need to make it under two minutes for the next circuit. Intermediate circuit. Customize. First off, balance gear, motor, mark three. From here, I think I'm gonna go with the rubber. Let's go to the middle. Switch tires to. Battery high capacity. We're still well within the area. We have gone out of the area. Okay, well, I didn't want to do that. <laughs> Let's take a test run. I think the motor is not a problem. It's the gear that... The gear is not the problem. It's the motor that's the problem. That's what I meant to say. Like this. Let's 
try it. it seems kind of slow. Power motor. And I just exited out again. Damn it. I feel like the motor that I'm using is just too weak. And I just left the game. Damn it! Why do I do this? I've been bypassing the menu for fucking no reason. Just at least tie with two more. Okay, I make all twelve in two minutes. I'll be fine with that. Could be also be my battery, but I don't know. Grip seems to be fine. I'm already a minute. Oh, yeah, okay. I'm gonna be just a little over two minutes. Actually, these soft tires are holding me a little bit back. Slicks. Is that a regular battery? We're still sitting at 23. Get this one. I feel like adding speed is just gonna fuck me up. Okay, I think we shaved off like. Or actually, we added a little bit more. Eight middle plus. First, keep in second. Oh, that slowed down the slopes, yeah. Lap is kind of being risky. Okay, 
It's very neutral at that time. Okay, balance gear with a high torque motor. Or regular spike tires. Nope, they're still too heavy. Let's try. Oh god, right away. That motor is too strong. This is actually pretty, running pretty well. Never mind, died. Okay, I need something else. I need something else. Missing something. Actually, is there? Well, everything's ready to uh, collect, so I don't think we have any problems so far. That burst of, at the end was not planned. down Kind of worth the pocket change, I guess. Camera. Hmm. 
Hey, what's the matter? You look upset. Mr. President, I'm disappointed in you. Mm -hmm. well, I never thought you were the kind of person who'd go to those kinds of places, Mr. President. Oi. Hey, hold your horses. What the heck are you talking about? Well, just look at this. It's a coupon for an adult shop. Dear valued customer, to show our appreciation for your repeat patronage, we'd like to offer you our services for absolutely free. Please drop by our shop with this postcard to redeem this exclusive offer. Mm. Absolutely free, huh? Wow. Huh? What do you mean, wow? To go to these kind of places so often they're giving you low heat rewards? Uh, no, that's not me. Well, at least I've never been to that shop. Then why did you get this postcard? Hey, wait, are you saying you've been to other places? I don't know what to think. Yeah. Hey, don't judge. Besides, are you sure it's really addressed to me? You sure it's not for Yamanoi, son? Yeah. Wow, don't drag me into this. Yeah. No, it's got to be for Yamanoi, son. The sender and dressy are... Huh? Yeah? What's wrong? It's addressed to me. See? I knew it. But the sender is the Pleasure King? What? Does this mean the Pleasure King is challenging you? Uh, most likely, yeah. We've taken over a bunch of properties in the Pleasure King's territory already. Makes sense. The Pleasure King has gangs and hooligans under his control. You should be careful you're going to face him. Uh. Right. Thanks for the heads up. This adult shop is on Senrio Avenue. I'll go check it out. Why not? It's absolutely free, right? <sighs> oh, come on. You know that's not why I'm going. The Pleasure King wants to see me. I should head over to Senrio Avenue. Well, I can't really do anything else, can I? Wait, can I do an interview? I want to do an interview. Before I head over there. <laughs> Mariana. What kind of person is it this time? Well, I looked at the application, but the photo is blurry and the handwriting is messy and legible. But the applicant's a college graduate. Oi. Hey, is it just me or did the quality of our applicants just fall off a cliff? Huh? Uh, don't get so picky. And there aren't many college grads who are willing to apply to a company like ours. We're short on manpower and don't have any other applicants, so beggars can't be choosers. Mm. I didn't know we were in such a bad. I didn't know we were in such bad shape. Well, we are. So, what do you want to do? Would you like to interview the applicant now? Uh. Okay, sure. I'll interview the candidate. Okay, then here we go. Please get ready for the interview. Please put on your glasses. Uh, okay. First impressions. <laughs> oh, there's something about a solidly built man wearing glasses, you know. No, no I don't. Oh, he's here. Let's do this interview. Uh. Yeah. Coming. Excuse me. Oh, okay. This is the wrong attitude for that. Uh, I, I am Saichi Koshimizu. Pleased to meet you. Meet you. S -s Sorry. I b b bit my tongue. P pleased to meet you. Have a seat. Uh, right. Thank you. Huh? Mm. The guy is super nervous. Mm. Yes, he is. He's so nervous, he's giving off the jitters, too. So, what kind of guy do we have here? A 
What's his resume say? It says his handwriting is terrible. I could hardly read it. What I could determine is that his name is Saichi Chimizu and that he's a university grad. So, you don't know anything about the guy? I'm surprised you even granted him in an interview. I'm sorry. Frankly, we're desperate for any help we can get. But with this guy, I think we can have to turn him down. Coming. I'll get the door. Sorry, we'll have to put the interview on hold. Eh. Yeah. Certainly. Koshimizu, why did you apply with us? Eh? Uh, pardon? Uh, isn't the inter interview on hold? Yeah. I just thought I'd talk to you while we wait. That should help you break the ice and be less nervous, right? Uh, I... I guess that's true. Thank you. When I was young, my father ran a small real estate agency. Oh, so your family business was in real estate. Eh. Yes. I remember the smiling faces of customers when they were leaving his office. Nobody went away unhappy. My father always said he wanted to make people happy through his work. And I was always so proud watching him do it. What I didn't understand at the time was that he made very little profit that way. Our fan finances were in shambles. I respect my father, but I don't want to be like him. Why is that? I want to make customers happy, but I also want to make my own family happy. The family I might have in the future. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sure I probably sound like some idealistic kid with no knowledge or real world experience. Shimizu, do you do mean every word of what you just said? Eh? Uh, yes, I think so. So, uh, pr pr probably. I don't think I lied to you, uh... He probably means what he said. He's not like the fake interviewers we met before. I think I can trust him with our work. Ah, but either way, I don't think I'll get the job here. Hmm? What makes you say that? I overheard your secretary saying you have to turn me down. Damn, yeah, you heard that. I don't want to waste any more of your time. I think I should leave you now. Nani? What? You're leaving? Eh. Yes. I'm sorry you had to do this for me. I don't need cab fare or anything. Oi. Hey, hold on. I think you deserve a chance. Don't just go. Eh? Really? But... In fact... Leaning toward hiring you. Eh? Huh? Huh? But you haven't even interviewed me yet. Sometimes you can tell the measure of a man by looking him in the eye and having a conversation. But thank you very much. But your secretary said I'm not good enough. Mm. Yeah, that's the problem. I let Marina handle all the hiring decisions. Who ought to hire Koshimizu? He has to win her approval. Koshimizu, there's only one thing I can tell you. Yes? Do your best in the interview and win my secretary over. Uh, uh, but I get really nervous. I always get rejected after interviews, even if I make it that far. It'll be fine. I'll help you as much as possible. So do your best. Hi. I, I'll do it. I, I might get nervous, but, but I'll give it my blessed effort. Oh boy, I'll have to help him out where I can so he can make a better impression Marina. I'm sorry for the holdup. Shall we resume our interview? Yes, please. I, I l l love interviews. I think this applicant is a bust. Let's get over this quickly and send him on his way so we can arrange for the next interview. Hey, noted to be that cold about it. He gets too flustered. He gets too flustered. Even if he's a good worker, I can't get have him getting all jittery in front of our clients. Okay, first things first. You have one minute. Koshimizu, tell us about yourself. Yeah, yeah, yeah yes. 
My name is Saichi Kujimizu. Pleased to meet you. At at university, I majored in eagle studies. I I think it help me help you help other people here. My stri st strengths are animals like me. Uh um, my hobby, my ho my hobby is to d dine out. I know lots of good places to eat around here. That is all. Thank you for your time. D lime time. I don't think he said a single thing that works. That's work related. More like a personal ad, wasn't it? He kept stumbling too. Mm. With that garbled delivery, it's possible to tell if Koshimizu kun would be useful to us. Marina's looking glum. If you don't turn her into round, you toast Ko Koshimizu. You said you majored in eagle studies. Can you explain what that is? Uh, uh huh. I said that. Yes, you did. I think you said that you could apply your knowledge of Eagle Studies to help us here. I'm s s sorry, I don't remember anything I said. Knowing Koshimizu, he probably stumbled over his words of nervousness. I better throw him a life vest. What did he mean by Eagle Studies? It must have been something that would have been some of. My <laughs> that must have been something that would be of some use to us here. What? Legal studies. That eagle studies thing? Did he mean legal studies? <gasps> that would make sense. If he has knowledge of legal matters, it would come in handy at a real estate firm. The housing laws go hand in hand with our business. Koshi Misuku, did you mean to say legal studies? Hi. Yes, that's it. I have legal studies degree. Oh, I'm sorry if I must have said something dumb. Eagle studies. Well, then, hmm. Marino seems to have a slightly better impression of Koshimizu now. Let's see. Your strength was that animals like you. Your hobby was dining out, so you know good places to eat. Is that correct? Hi. Yes. Well, we don't have much time. We should ask him to get into either his strength or his hobby in detail. Which would you like to hear about? Or you need to get in a good impression. Koshimisa would be useful in the real estate. Would focus on his strength and prove her impression of him or his hobby? His hobby. Tell us more about your hobby of dying out. Yeah. Yes. I I love discovering good places to eat. Oh, I uh often dine out all over town. I've gone through Kamarocho thoroughly. I'm familiar with nearly all restaurants in the like in the town. I to think I know them all. Hmm. I you always know, don't know how that hobby would be useful. I think his knowledge of dining establishments could be invaluable. Hmm? How do you figure? Dining establishments are commercial properties too. Popular places might, con recon uh, might consider expansion. Unpopular residents might turn into vacant storefronts. I see. If dining out is his hobby, he might have up-to-date information on things like that. Marina's... Uh, Marina. Marina's opinion of Koshimizu seems to have improved a little bit. Okay, let's move on to the final part, Mr. President. Do you have any questions for Koshimizu? Kun? Eh? <laughs> questions from the President himself? Yes, indeed. Uh, I'm happy to answer any questions. Uh, okay. Your firm is an innovator of cutting-edge synergy that challenges the industry med uh, metrics. My career plan is shared vision and engagements, insights, uh, conversion? Oi, Koshimizu, just relax. As soon as he get back to his regular interview format, he got so nervous he started spewing buzzwords. Better to ask Koshimizu a question that he can make a good impression with, without getting flustered. Koshimizu, there's someone you look up to, isn't there? Hi. Yes, but I already told you about him earlier. Ah, good. But I want to hear it again. Take your time. Can you do that? Eh. Yes. So, so that's why I don't, I don't want to be like my father. 
I want to be a real estate agent who can make both my clients and my family happy. Well said, Koshimizu. Hi. Well, it might be because we were already talking about it earlier. You talked about this while I was away? Uh, yeah. Koshimizu Kun is a pretty good guy, isn't he? Looks like Marina's impression of Koshimizu may have taken a positive turn. That's it for our interview. Thank you for your time. Hi. Okay. Uh, thank you. Let's move right along to our decision. President Kiryu. I have no objections whatsoever. The decision rests with you, Mr. President. Uh, okay. Koshimizu, you're hired. Eh? What? Really? Yes, yes! <laughs> Congratulations and welcome aboard. Here's your cat pair, too. Eh? Oh, really? Are you sure it's alright? I mean, you gave me a job, and now even cat pair? <laughs> of course, that's what we promised. Now that you're hired, we would like you to start as soon as possible. Can you start tomorrow? Hi. Yes. I'm afraid I don't have any experience to offer, but I will do my best for you. Thank you. Yay. We're counting on you. Hi. Yes, sir. Do you think Koshimizu-kun will actually show up tomorrow? Ah. Uh. No. Oh. You think Koshimizu-kun will actually show up tomorrow? Think so. If he had that much trouble with the truth, imagine what he'd be like trying to lie to us. I hope you're right. Hmm. <gasps> oh, Koshi Mizugun forgot his bag. We have to take it to him. Why would he need to do that? He's coming in tomorrow. Oh, for goodness sake. What if this was his wallet or rail pass? We can't be very far. Can you run after him and get him to wait? I'll follow you with the bag. Okay, okay. Wait, is this a setup? Am I being set up right now? Oi. Uh, hey, Koshimizu. Where are you? Where did he go? Hmm? Shit, I still get pissed thinking about the kid your guy. I still calls himself a company president. <laughs> I totally get where you're coming from. I shouldn't take it out on a dog, though. You might piss on your suit. <laughs> but that cry is so satisfying. That kid you making those bitchy little noises. That right, dog? <laughs> These motherfuckers. It's them. Stop that! Stop! Stop hurting that dog! Koshi... Koshimizu. Huh? What's with this guy? He's shaking like a leaf. Sh shoot up! If, if you don't stop abusing that dog, I, I won't let you! Sheesh. This guy's a real piece of work. Ijikun, you make him go away. Oh. With pleasure. Let's see how you feel after... this. <laughs> <laughs> How do you like that? That's what being a hero gets you. I'm not finished with you. Huh? huh? What's with you? What? You? Uh, I'm not done with you. Uh, what's with this creep? He's freaking me out. Let's get out of here. Okay. Okay. <sighs> I did it. You you're safe now. I'm so glad. <laughs> Ouch! Stop it! It tickles. You're getting slobber all over my face. Ow! 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 Listen, kill you, Koshi Mizu's kun. See? Aren't you glad we hired the guy? Yes. Yes, I am. Yoshimizu, welcome to the team. The security? In the end, it 
entertainment business as well. What a guy! I am kind of sorry I gave him that voice. <laughs> okay, I need the save. And then I need to take a piss. Actually, am I ready to collect again? Oh! The Pleasure King's kind of expecting me. Oh boy. Okay, I need to take a piss. I'll be right back. Okay. Do you want an accurate Final Fantasy XIV meme using Fallout Show? Yeah, sure. Send it to me. Why am I so mean? And also, oh my. <laughs> How was I being so mean? Okay. All right, we're gonna talk with the Pleasure King now. I actually don't know if you sent it to me. Oh, nope, you just sent it to me just now. <laughs> okay. That's fair. It's Robin. How much money do I have? Okay, I have more money than he has. He's not worth it. Oh, he is sleeping. No, just leave it. Just leave it. 
Okay, we need drugs. Are you really blocking up the whole fucking street? <laughs> like, what the heck, man? What are you doing blocking off the whole street? Oh, okay. Wait, what happened to the rest of his team? It's like they forgot to spawn in. <laughs> he just showed up by himself. Mm. What should I try today? Oi, uh, you. What are you doing here? Hey, buddy. What's it look like I'm doing? I'm shopping. I'm trying to decide which energy drink I should get. Oh. Even a guy like you needs energy? Yeah. Oh no, not at all. I never needed to pick me up. But when a bottle says it delivers wonderful down under, how could anyone resist the urge to try? Hey. Mm. Okay. Anyway, are you getting any lately? That's not what I'm here for. Not even every not everyone's like you. You kidding? Then what are you doing in Kamarocho with the land of sexy ladies? Not is it? Duh. Let's see, for example, there's this real estate office on Supon Street. The secretary's a knockout. Super cute. Maybe I'll go look for her if I feel like it. <laughs> what wouldn't I give to get my hands on a video of a girl like her? I'd keep it under lock and key and treasure it forever and ever and ever. You know, she must say. Okay, there we go. Okay, where's this meetup supposed to end? Uh, meetup at San Rio Avenue. Defeat the Pleasure King. But I don't remember where we're supposed to meet up. Uh oh. Well, let's run around and we'll find out. Pretty sure it's on San Rio Avenue. Probably at the end of that. Uh, oh. We're in the inside of this stadium area, that's right here. Are you ready to fight? No, I found him. Is that? <laughs> it was so awful today. Oh, honey, I know how you feel. I realize it was hard for you. But you know, you really can't deny your customer like that. Eh? You quit now. All your hard work would be for nothing. <sighs> but... You'll be okay. Nothing bad will happen. Leave it to me, honey. You trust me, don't you? Hi? Yes, of course. I've never been able to trust anyone else in this business, but I trust you like an older sister. Then, <laughs> you do what your big sister says, okay? Just hang in there a bit more for me. Oh, okay. Thanks for looking out for me. I'll work even harder. Oh. Hmm. What a basic biatch. Complaining about a customer's little fetish like that. 
Jaguar Chan. Yes! I think it's about time we offer that little tuna to the usual fish market. Fish market. To them? Don't you think it might be a little bit too soon for that? Let's see how things go. You that hussy getting huffy over a little thing like that. We can't expect to make much off her in the future. Besides, she's worked enough to pay her debt, and then some. You might realize it soon, so now's the time to do it. Understood. <laughs> oh, women are so stupid, and the men who spend big money on them are equally stupid. I suppose in the end, they're all just idiots beating each other out. Well, let's... Oh my, if it isn't a kid of you, John, you naughty boy. You should have let me know you were here. You look sexy as a person. Mm -hmm. So, did you come to have some fun? Our free coupon got your attention, did it? You're a big boy with a healthy appetite. After all, kid of you, John. No, that's not it. You're the one who called me out here. Yeah. Oh, now that you mention it, you're right. I absolutely forgot about that. Silly me. No. Honey, won't you play a little game with me? Mm, a game? You took on the Leisure <laughs> King in the karaoke battle, right? I want some one-on-one -on -one time with you, too. What kind of battle would that be? Mm, let's see. We're all adults here, so we can make it something fun. Oh, God. Oh, I know. Let's make it a telephone club battle. Wait, how does that work? Nanny, telephone club battle? Eh. Right. If you manage to score a date with a girl within three minutes, you win. How's that? Hot stuff? Of course, if you win, you get a slice of my property pie. If you lose, you get a share of... You give me a share of your holdings instead. This is very uncomfortable. What do you mean? Oh, how can I trust you? You run these you run these places. Isn't there going to be some kind of a catch? Huh. I'm not going to do anything shady. That's the T for truth. The game's no fun if you cheat. Don't you trust me? We'll use the Telltale Boys Club. I'm not involved in the management there. So the battle will be fair and square. Would that be okay with you? Uh, sure, that's fine. Uh oh. <laughs> okay then. Let's do this. Nah. Okay, let's get it on, honey. If I win, I'll score a deal with a girl in three minutes, right? <laughs> That's right. No shame, but you don't seem like the type to go to telephone clubs. Do you really think you can pull this off? <laughs> don't judge a book by its cover. また。俺、会ってくれるんだから、会ってもらおう。もしもし。もしもし。もしもし。そうだな。可愛い声してるな。Wait, isn't this the, this the one that skipped out on us? This is the one that skipped out on us. Yeah, ちょっとブラがきつくなってきちゃって新しいのかなちゃんちゃんちゃんちゃんちゃんちゃんちゃんちゃんちゃんちゃんちゃんちゃんちゃんちゃんちゃんちゃんちゃんちゃんちゃん
変なこと聞かないでよそうだなチャームポイントはどこだ全部かななんちゃって。Why am I getting bugged? ああ、甘えてくれ。甘えちゃうぞ。そうだな。育ちが良さそうだな<笑>どうかなあれまで来たこれもどんな顔をしているんだ顔<笑>カード 4K? What the heck? 私のこと知りたいの色っぽい顔してるねって言われるよえー、なんで私だってもう大人の女なんだよそうだな若そうだなピピチだよ Barely legal? That's not good お前とならできそうだ私もできたら嬉しいなそうだなあ、はあ、いい人いないかなあああああああああああああOut of date, and we win the Pleasure Kings challenge. How was that? I scored a date. <laughs> oh, honey, I should have known you get around. You were fabulous. Congratulations. Hmm? Fabulous? Wait, how did you know the, how the conversation went? Yeah. His way. The color on the under other end was me. Nani? No, how can that be? That voice was completely different. Oh, don't underestimate the pleasure, King. It's easy peasy for me to change up my voice like that. I got psyched out? Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> well, but your seduction technique was so fierce. You really turned me on. I'm never going to make this mistake again. Oh, come on. Don't be so uptight. We had a little fun. I'll give you my share of my area as promised. Okay, 10%. I won. Somehow I feel like I lost. Oh dear, you managed to close the gap between with me again. I better get serious pretty soon. Oh, Jaguar Chan. I, I, I totally forgot how I did this one. Yes! <laughs> what? Be a dear and take care of him, would you? Nani? Hey! You haven't taken advantage of our absolutely free service offer yet. Right? This is my present for you, honey. And don't forget, I'm not gonna let you off so easy next time. <laughs> that is, of course, if you manage to survive after dealing with these boys. Well then, I hope you enjoy our service. Oi. Hey, wait. Oh, 
Excuse me, sir. You don't need to deal with us. No substitutions allowed during this promotion. <laughs> okay, let's get started. Enjoy our absolutely free service. Wow, oh, fight time, huh? Picked up a bike in one. Talk about a rough customer. Sorry about that. Don't worry. I'll never come back to a place like this. Pleasure key. He's more tough and cold blooded than I thought. I'll have to face him in a ba battle soon. It's not going to be easy. I did win. But at what cost? I feel like if. Feel like I still lost in this battle. Actually, do I have a hundred million? I do not. Excuse me. All of you are fucked up. Okay, we gotta collect a new. Now you know why you felt uncomfortable? Why did you feel uncomfortable? Was it because of Patrick? <laughs> I feel like you're gonna mention Patrick. I knew it was coming. <laughs> okay. I thought it might have been because of Patrick. That video about Patrick that he sent me, it really kind of fucked me. A couple bees? Nugget's doing good. He hasn't been challenged yet, which is kind of funny. Okay, we need to find the last part, uh, the last two parts of uh, Pink Street. We can buy out that property in full. We're sitting, we're sitting at a good fair margin. With, with, uh, he was a threat, and now he's kind of just being dumbed down. Then we can just straight up just buy him out. Okay, we went too far. 
Where was the other sign? I think it is somewhere around. No, we bought that one already. No, nope, it's not this one. This one, this one. The grind of the kings. Yeah, it's just grinding. Two places, two or three places that I need to buy. Uganda Arts, Cabaret Valentine, Moscow Western Cuisine. Wait, Valentine is in this area, isn't it? Oi, <laughs> 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 Out of the way. Gundam Arts. Heck yes. Okay, we got another property. Actually, it's been a while since we've taken a gamble in this situation. It's gonna suck entirely for me because I don't know what's gonna happen. But I'm gonna bet on one of the safe girls. I'm pretty sure you <laughs> If you take a second to think about it, I think you know where it's gonna go from here. <laughs> yes, it deserves a bonk. I think this time we're gonna go with Francisca. And see how we do with that. At least five million yen should be the safe and fair amount, right? I mean, I can bet my entire pocket and it wouldn't matter to me now. With all the money that I've been making with just real estate, it'll be fine. Francisco against Jennifer? Are you kidding me? Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, are you ready for a cat fight? 
Okay, let's go. Just party time, Beth. So, let's have fun. In this You can actually win through this. That sounds so fun. And she's down. I'm a winner. Win. We proceed. She could win. You ni katsume wa arimasen. Zette wa kenishu. No Paper, okay. Ouch. No, 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 no! No, what? Are you kidding me? I lit up for like a second, a half second. That is bullshit. And because it wasn't my button pressing, it was fucking. Oh god. No, are you kidding me?
Are you kidding me? I gave him one button press in like half a second. Are you fucking kidding me? And the next situation, I just got fucking owned and just fucking like none of my presses honestly like dampered any of that situation. The whole rainbow that came out of that? Are you fucking kidding me? It didn't stop. It just said fuck you. Wow. Maybe if this was normal, I might have had a fair chance. But no, after that, just saw that, it's just like, no, fuck you. You have nothing to show for this effort that you put in. And I'm button mashing the shit out of this. <laughs> Even Metal Gear Solid. Uh, Metal Gear, uh, t <laughs> Metal Gear Solid 4, Guns of the Patriots. Mashing that triangle button at that very end part of this series was more forgiving than this bullshit. Get the running man. Oh, I'm running the wrong way. This is definitely a dead end. Well, so far, the Pleasure King has given us more information on this other part. So, actually, it has been a while, and I know this seems kind of degenerate, but we might as well go through the rock video. It has been like three streams and we've like seen anything, but I don't know. It might add something. There might be a new quest or something like that. I don't know for sure. But we might as well enjoy ourselves for just a little bit, for like uh, maybe a 30 seconds or something or so. I don't know. Bolo mo ke, bolo mo ke. Jerin jerin kaseguze.
Learn Curse. Break up. I should probably save and then come back again. I actually really need to take another piss. Which is fair. It's been about a good hour. All right, I'll bring it back. I'll bring it back. All right. What is the last part that I need? Moscow Western Cuisine in Cabaret Valentine. I feel like I found out where Valentine was. I thought it was right across the... Um, uh, harassment cop. Was it just down the line? I thought I knew where it was. <laughs> now it feels like a fucking lie. <laughs> Okay, we do know that it's not on the north side, so... Oh, 
I mean, it could be. Cake is alive. Maybe the lie is the cake. Have you ever thought about that? I feel like it's one of these ones. I mean, this entire area is covered in uh, the Pleasure King business. Oh no, wasn't it right here? Like just after this area. Like right at the end, I believe. I don't know if that's true. Whoa! Whoa! Got Western cuisine. Let me close. Oh, well. Maybe we're gonna quit for now. What is Cabaret Valentine? I feel like it was on uh oh, I feel like it was oh. on a uh, Pink Street. But I... hmm. Maybe I'm lying to myself. Wait. Oh, this is the shogi. We're not ready for this. Give me a gear three or something. Nope, another cap on. I found it. It's right at the beginning. That should be the last property I should be able to buy. Yeah. Oh. Okay, by now it should be replenished. Um well, the thing I said we were going to do is we need to watch the erotic videos. I think we'll get an upgrade to our... Hey, million yen machine. To our friendship. Uh, a bar, but uh, we can see what's going to happen. Yeah. 
A million men machine. We have prayed for this day. <laughs> and we get absolute garbage. Yep, expect that. I lost health on this guy. Um. I think we need to take time to watch a couple of videos. This kind of safe for work videos, you know? As safe as they can get. <laughs> money, 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 money. Let's watch a video. Let's watch Luca Kanai. Hands are very red. I'm kind of concerned about that, but that's a different issue. I like bubbles. Get to watch for free. Uh. What are you doing? Hey, what are you doing? <laughs> are you just arguing with yourself? What are you doing? You want attention? You want pay? It's a problem. Ooh. We got some time. We want us to watch a little bit more. Irashimasu. Let's watch another video. Okay, Riku Minato was one of the ones that we got fully cut it out. Here we go.
you know? So, <laughs> that last set of video that we just watched, this is a very weird case for two different opposing sides of attraction, which is you can either be cu you can either be cute and not sexy. Or you can be sexy but not cute. However, every once in a while, you find that little treasure that crosses that little line of being both cute and also sexy. Those very rare instances where those two lines cross is very wonderful. To see. I feel like that video kind of showed off what potential that has. Talking. <laughs> okay, let's collect more money and buy out the pleasure king. I feel like Majima was the only one that had the friendship relationship with the Radic video man. going on mm. Oi, what's the matter you look you look upset again again mr. president mm -hmm. we have postcards from sex shops again in fact we have two of them this time <sighs> Ooh, I bet they're from the pleasure King dear valued customer join us this holiday for a Christmas miracle I wish to protect your halls by punish you in the Santa costume. Of course, you can be the naughty red-nosed reindeer. Please drop by and check us out for a special event. We look forward to seeing everyone on the naughty list. Hmm. Is that the challenge for the pleasure kid? What on earth could he mean by Santa costume? Is that a secret message? Yeah. Hey, God. This is addressed to you, Yamanoi son. It? What? Oh, is that from where I went the other day? No, no, that can't be. What? Huh? Yeah, I'm a noise, son. Uh, um, well, I, uh, oh, so, what? Don't judge me. So what about the other postcard? The other one is actually from the Pleasure King. The text is the same as last time. I guess he wants to go to the same place as before. Hmm. Considering the Pleasure King's area is mostly ours now, he must be quite desperate. I'm betting he'll try to shut us down by force. We're going to make sure you're ready for anything. Uh, you're right. On the flip side, this is also an opportunity for us to crush them. To put an end to this. We're counting. We're counting on you, Kiryu san. Please be careful, Mr. President. Uh, yeah. Yamanoi-san, may I have a word with you, with you later? Sure. I need to head to Senryo Avenue to face the Pleasure King. Okay, we save. Let me see how this goes from here.
Okay, we're gonna bet it all on this uh, meeting. <laughs> if we win this, we're great. If we lose this, well, we're stuck in this situation we don't want to be stuck in. I mean, losing 10% doesn't seem that bad, but it can also be pretty detrimental to my money. Decided to come, Kiryu-chan. I love a man with courage. It's so sexy. I'm not here for your sweet talk. Hurry up and tell me what you want. <laughs> <laughs> Don't be so hasty, honey. I'll tell you what, Kiryu-chan. I'll give you one chance. One chance to pull all out of this area right now. If you do, I'll spare your life. Everyone gets a happy ending. And if I don't? Oh, you know what's going to happen? I'll get rid of anyone who gets in my way. If you don't pull out, I'll we'll kill you. And I'll take it all back. <laughs> Fine. But let me say something, too. Leave this area now. If you do, I'll let you live. <laughs> <laughs> Fabulous. But then let's settle this, shall we? I'm sorry, honey. You're all by your lonesome. I've got my entourage here. But you understand, um, it's because I'm a vulnerable little girl, don't you? I'm sure you don't mind. <laughs> yeah, right. The muscles you're packing there say you're anything but, but that's fine. I'll take you all out. Yeah. Oh, you're so mendy. If you weren't my enemy, I'd be all over you, big boy. Well, I'll give you the Pleasure King's whole of its service. All for absolutely free, honey. So get ready to take it all in. Wow. Very, very suggestive.
Finish him off. He's still alive. Watch out! See us. Come to the complete domination. Lovers. <laughs> if we weren't enemies, we could have been friends, maybe. Friends? Oh, you're such a tease. Like you promised, you need to leave this area. Sure, I did promise after all. Besides, now that people are starting to pick up on some tricks, I was turning on the down low. It's time for me to pull out and sashay away. I'll start again somewhere else, honey. Some place where no one will get in the way of how I run my runaway. Next time, make sure you think about people over profits. <laughs> I'll keep that in mind. After all, I don't want someone like you swooping in and snatching away my business again. Honey, are you serious about taking back Camarocho? Uh, yeah, you bet. Okay, yeah. Listen. Take me down, we'll help you get rid of the five billionaires. A new billionaire will rise up to take place. There are plenty of rich boys ready to take, get nasty for that chance. So, what should I do? You need to find the beef beneath the bulge. 
The one who's really controlling the five billionaires. Hmm. Isn't that the one? Isn't that one of the five? Ooh, I'll never tell. I'd be killed if I said too much. I hope you understand if I bite my tongue, honey. Well, no need for me to hang around much longer. I should get running. Here, a present for you. What's this? My phone number, honey. Call me anytime, kitty you chan What? I don't want it. Oh, you're just being bashful. We're no longer enemies, after all. And since we're no longer enemies, I'd be happy to give you some pointers on managing adult entertainment centers. Mm. That might actually be helpful. Fabulous. Of course, it absolutely won't be for free. You're still all business, aren't you? Oh, and my boy Jaguar Chan here, he still wants to work in Kamaruchi. I don't mind paying him. He's such a good boy. He's always eager to please. Uh, that's fine. We all need the help. We all need the help we can get. Thank you very much. New advisor and a new security person. Cool. See you later, Kitty Yutan. Maybe you can clean up this town a little bit and save it from all the greed and butts. I'll be watching over you from afar, honey. Do your best. So then, who's actually controlling the five billionaires? Looks like the rabbit hole only gets deeper. Ouch. Shmagoo. You clod. Ow. Magoo. What type of voice should I work with this? It seems the Pleasure King has been taken down as well. <sighs> Indeed. That curio character, I didn't think he'd get this far. Hmm? What should we do? Shall I take him out now? Yeah. Leave him alone. We don't know if we're going to be able to beat him either. What? Ouch. My feelings. For once, we got someone who can give us an interesting challenge. Let's sit back and enjoy this while it lasts. <laughs> what was the voice that I was doing? You know, this is a good opportunity to see what the rest of you are capable of. You understand what I mean, don't you? Certainly, we're merely the hands and feet at your command. Kazuma Koo. Kazuma Kiyo to you. <laughs> I don't know why, but the first thing that popped in my head is make this man Louis Armstrong. <laughs> That's the first voice that popped in my head. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna save and end the stream for today. Because, well, it's nearly six o'clock. And I am very hungry now. So, for now, I think that's where I'll end stream as we pack up this saving situation that has doubled over twice. Anyway. I think it's been uh, a pretty good night of uh, progression. We've taken down three of the five kings. Simply because time is of the essence. And, uh, well, the whole side situation. I thought I really honestly had a side friend in the whole Raga videos store. But it turned out to be absolutely nothing. So, anyway, with that being said, I think it's time for me to head to bed with As It Goes. <laughs> yeah, it's barely nearly serious. near six o'clock. I'm going to stretch out real quick Ugh. before I get ready for bed. Anyway, I think since, uh, well, we have tomorrow off. I have tomorrow off. And so. 
if I wake up early enough, we'll have a variety stream side A and then variety stream side B later on, depending on how much we drink while I decide to go watch Fallout tomorrow. Because Fallout has been a game, uh, a series that has been so good so far. And so, I hope to enjoy what I see tomorrow. Episode 5, well, episode 6, 7, and probably really 8 is what we're going to go for for tomorrow. And I really want to enjoy what's going to happen. But anyway, it's time for bed. I say goodnight to you. I say goodnight to me. And I will play the end song as it should be. Bye-bye.